For something called a deep plane facelift, it sounds very intense. It sounds like it might hurt. So can you tell us uh, about the procedure? And I mean, does it hurt before, after? What, tell us about, about this process. That's a very good question. The short answer to that is it does not hurt much at all. In fact, most patients are surprised uh, that rather than pain, they have numbness. Um, so first of all, during the surgery, it is done under general anesthesia. So you'll be uh, completely asleep and completely pain-free. Once you wake up, there will be impact of the painkillers that you will be given. So you will be numb. A day or two after the surgery, you will be more aware of a numbness on your face and neck area rather than pain. So there isn't any sharp pain in any area at all. Some of the patients do experience dull ache, particularly above their ear or behind the ear, uh, but the face and the neck area itself it remains completely numb or mostly numb rather than uh, in pain. As the sensation comes back over the next few weeks to month, they will experience a bit of tingling uh, around their face and neck area as the nerves regrow for the, uh, the sensory nerves to the skin regrow. But do not worry about having pain. It is not a painful surgery. In fact, it is more comfortable than having, for example, your tooth extracted. Well, that's reassuring. So there is no real sharp pain and uh, you don't have to worry about that. And then there's numbness, which I understand it makes sense that your skin nerves need to regrow, which is a really interesting thing <laughs> in and of itself. So, so then is there any um, psychological sort of pain or discomfort that you would say during the process that you find patients have? Okay. So deep plane face lift surgery, like any other surgery, will can have some psychological impact. So not just for deep plane surgery, if you undergo any surgery which is over three to four hours under general anesthesia, mm -hmm. it can make you feel tired for mm -hmm. some times. It can have, uh, you know, you, you will be slightly swollen in your face. And uh, if you couple it with the uh, grogginess that comes with general anesthesia and the tiredness that results after any three to four hour long surgery, does lead to many patients feeling out of their comfort for the mm -hmm. first week. Yeah. Um, the best uh, way out of them uh, to get out of this is to make sure that they keep hydrated, mm -hmm. they keep walking and uh, they walk around within their degree of comfort. But by the end of a week, you are back to normal. Mm -hmm. um, depending upon your mental attitude before the surgery, your psychological recovery can, can take some time. And we do actually uh, give our patient a graph that depicts the psychological journey mm -hmm. after a major surgery, which helps them come to term because they are aware of the psychological cycle before the surgery itself, which helps their recovery. Mm -hmm. But overall, the key thing for you to remember is that it is not a painful surgery. There is a degree of recovery involved within the first week, but by the end of the week, you should expect yourself to be where you were um, in, before the surgery. Hi, we've got something fun for you. We have a quiz below that will help you to understand whether deep clean facelift or other techniques surrounding the face might be right for you. So uh, take a moment, have some fun and take the quiz below.